Welcome to Rakuen. I believe that's how it's pronounced. Uh, I, I, I'm gonna go ahead and say that. I, I, I mean, if that's not how it's pronounced, then please correct me, but... Yeah, this is uh, Rakuen. And if I am correct, I just did put it through translate. It translates to paradise in Japan. Or Japan, Japanese, but... Uh, anyways, that's... This game is loud. Uh, that's really all I know about this game. I think this might be like a, a somewhat of a sad game, so if I cry, whatever, it's, you'll cry too, I swear. I don't know. I don't know. All right, uh, anyways, yeah, we're just going to... my mouse? Where's my mouse? There it is. Yeah, we're just going to start a new story. Like I said, I do not know. Nothing up. Oh, arrow keys! Oh. Space enter to talk to people. Of course, escape is the menu. You need to talk with mom when she's with you. Okay. Also, sorry for like the background noise. Not my fan. Going right now. Jesus. Who's there? Oh. Yeah. Hey. How'd you get in here? You took something like a man. Oh. Who are you? Oh, yeah, I live across the hall. Did you just move in or something? I think it got here around the same time as you. But they never let me out of my room. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay. I sneak out at night when the nurses aren't watching. <laughs> promise you won't tell anyone I'm in here, okay? Get that out of the way. I promise. So, how long are you in here for? I don't know. Mom says it could be a while. Same here. It gets real boring sometimes. I know what you mean. Something's coming. Sorry, man. I gotta go. Alright, goodbye. Hey, wait! Yeah? Maybe I could visit you sometime. Yeah, it's boring when there's two. You won't be able to get into my room. I'm not even supposed to leave, remember? Oh, yeah. But don't worry. I'll come visit you again. I promise. Jesus. Yeah, I mean, where'd you go? You just watched him leave. Me, I guess. That's supposed to be me. Oh. Oh. Patient 237. Extra diosidium, 800 milligram once. What? I, you expect me to say these big words? I can barely, I can barely like say sentences. Treatment guide. Oh. An origami hat. Open the cabinet. Why not? The cabinet is empty. Wall diggity darn. The door is locked. There's a sound on the door. Read it? Yeah, why, is, why not? Storage area 2B. Agent's not allowed beyond this point. Somebody's calling me. Hello? Hey, dear. It's Mom. Mom! Just wanted to let you know that my train was delayed. So, I'm gonna be a bit late. Oh. Okay. I'm so sorry, dear. I'm going as fast as I can. It's okay, Mom. I understand. I'm off work this week, and I dropped off, I dropped off your little brother. Yeah, your little brother at grandma's house. See what I mean? I came and <sighs> formulated sense. So we'll be able to spend lots of time together. We can play games. I'll read to you. It'll be like our own little party. Thanks, mom. I love you. I love you too. Oh, it's the doctor. Well, well, I see you're wide awake and walking around. 
Someone told me I couldn't walk around. <laughs> okay, wise guy. I got a couple things to tell you. First of all, some good news. Some good news. Your tests have come back, and it turns out things are looking pretty good. In fact, I think it might be okay for you to walk around the halls a bit today. You mean? I get to leave my room? Indeed. Yes. <laughs> Not so fast. There's something else I need to talk to you about. This morning, the cafeteria reported a lot of food and drinks were stolen from the kitchen. Since the wing was all locked up last night, we believe that a thief might still be in the building somewhere. So you take a moment to just check and see if any of your belongings were stolen. Okay. Why is this game so loud? One second. I turned it down. I turned it down. Where's my mouse? Oh no! It's gone! Doctor, they took it! They took Rack Raccoon! What did they take? Raccoon! It's my favorite book in the whole world! My mom reads it to me every night. It's very special. Are you completely sure you just didn't misplace it? I'm sure! After mom finishes reading me, reading, she always puts it back in the same place. I'm sorry. <laughs> It's our tradition. <laughs> okay, calm down. What does the book look like? Hmm. It has a brown cover. It looks very old. And it's a clasp made of silver with a, hole, with a hole for a key. Silver clasp, eh? This explains why they take a children's storybook. Well, I'm really sorry about this. I can only imagine how important it must have been to you. I want to know that we'll be doing all we can to track down the thief. I'm just gonna be so sad. You know what? But, since you're allowed to leave your room, why don't you talk to some of the old other folks around the floor? Who knows? Maybe they'll be able to get your book back. You care now? I'll be back to check on you in a bit. Houseplant? Houseplant? It looks like I can use some water. Oops. Well... What's the bathroom? You have to take a tinker. I'm a child. With the sink. Yes! The sink is filled with water. Woo! A mirror. Well then. How's your detective work coming along? Find any good leads? You know it! Hello. I heard you had a pretty tough day today. You hang in there, right? You're doing great. I don't know how much I want to explore. Hello though, mister. Tony. What the heck you think you're doing in my room, kid? Get out! I figures when I'm a visitor, no one shows up, but I need peace and quiet every day in the world has to come to my room. Where's that nurse with my coffee? Hello there. There's no point talking to Tony before he's had his coffee. He'll just growl at you. Growl at you like a big angry bear. I hear that, you little brat. Let's see what I mean. You know what? Is this, is this the book? A broken music box. If you touch that music box, I'll break your hands. Jesus. Treatment guide. Well, I I will I see I am not wanted here. Is there anybody in here? The door's locked. Look at the sign. Keep out! Only authorized personnel allowed to be on this point. Okay then. Hey there. What's up? Hmm. I think we formally met. I'm Cora. It's probably. Yeah, it's probably pretty easy to remember me because I'm the only girl with a pink mohawk. Whoa, cool! Don't worry, my mom knows. She's the one, well, she's the one who let me do it. Anyway, it's nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too, Cora. Oh, hey, some friends. Some friends and I are working together to do some special for people on our floor in the hospital. Like what? I'll have more details later. But if you find anything cool you want to donate, come talk to me. Okay. Yeah, I know a lot of f folks feel powerless when they have to stay here. That's why, I, the way I see it, no one knows how much time they have in this world. My time, my time could be up in 80 years or eight minutes. That's depressing. Point is, I'm going to do everything I can to make good use of my time. Time's precious, you know. If I could help just one person here to feel happier, that'd be worth it. 
Sure about the thief? Dude, yeah. Chef Panky came out here earlier and said was not happy. I guess the thief, the, yeah, I guess the thief took a lot of food from the cafeteria kitchen. Oh, damn it. I can't even get there. I can't even get there from the cafeteria. Believe me, I've tried. Well, I'll talk to you later. Oh, damn it. I don't know how long I'll have this episode be. Hello there. Jackie. Hello, small child. <laughs> what brings you to the blood draw station? Interested in learning about circulatory system pellets? Petrol motion machines? What can I help you with? What's up? Sometimes I like to contemplate things like why are there only two egg laying mammals in the world? I'm sure many species could benefit from laying eggs. But so far, only the platypus and the kidnap families have hopped on the bandwagon. What if I could have laid eggs? He's laying eggs at the time. Yeah, that's my response as well. I gotta go! <laughs> Did you call me? Yeah. Apparently, the tone in the room is broken now. Can you do anything about it? I'm a nurse, not a plumber. I don't even know how to fix a toilet. Well, someone has to do it. You know how short staffed we are. Fine, right, I'll go see if I can dig up some supplies. Hello. Quit bugging me, kid. I've got a lot of things to do right now. My stomach's growling. What I wouldn't even give to get a peanut choo choo. Now, where did I put my key? I must have dropped it somewhere. The door is locked. I guess all these other doors are locked. Oh, nope. Hello there, sir. And I'll be back for a selling solution. I'm sorry if I put you in this stand, but... Kiss a bro? I haven't seen you in a long time. It's good to see you walking around again. Need something? What's up? It seems these days are getting harder and harder to find word, find the words. Either that or people just aren't listening. But, you know, it's my time to leave this world and I'm ready to go. I just want to make sure I say the things I need to before it's too late. What are you drinking? <laughs> Does it smell bad? It's a new kind of tea you've been experiment with, experimenting with. This don't even seem to be too thrilled about me drinking experimental things. But I don't care. Folks here just don't seem thrilled with a lot of things I do. Ah, fuck it, damn it. <sighs> what the hell is this? It appears there's a tunnel rolling through the here that has been blocked off. Why is there a tunnel? Well... This is the cafeteria. Who are you? Hospital stuff. The new patient lines are still being built. Please come back later. This is indeed the cafeteria. Uh, is, is that a cat? I offer freshly made plushy toys. Okay. Hey kiddo, do you need something? What's up? I'm just finishing with a batch of plushies. I could also make one for all the patients on the floor. Even the cranky old men like Tony and Panky. Hey, I heard that! Good. <laughs> oh, I was say about the thief. Don't tell anybody I told you this, but... You know, I have some of the doors around here that have been electrically locked boxes on them. And that they keep some of the passwords somewhere inside the reception desk across the room from Kisabu... Kisaburo's room. What do you think is beyond those doors? I mean, you haven't been there? What? No, of course not. I'm just a volunteer. I'll see you later. This is a cat. Meow. I told you you're not supposed to have cats in the hospital. It's fine. She's seeing eye cat. Her vision is really bad. Get it out of here, Danielle. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Panky's the worst. All right, Panky Panky, who are you? Get your stuff. Oh. Hey there, long time no see, buddy. You hungry? Need something? What's up? Did you hear? They finally sucked a vending machine outside the hospital, all with peanut choo choos. The shift leader was in there the other day, begging us to do it. This is not just about the kids. I guess it's not the kids that they love them. Oh, see you later. Well, I guess I'll go see if I can go get a vending choo choo, whatever it's called. <laughs> Semi functional vending machine. What would you like? Me choo choos. Do I have money? I am broke! I'm gonna take the time to save. How long have I been going? 15 minutes, alright. Let's let's make this a 30 minute episode. Mm 
How do I get money? Open oh, the cabinet. This is a medical form. It's like there's something beneath the folders. Looking underneath? Yeah. Found ten gold. Cabinet is empty. Well, I need to go. I, well, I'm assuming I have to go get that. I have to go give a. Uh, Sorry, looks like something beneath the lab coat. You wanna look underneath? Found 5G! You nice to your mom. She works really hard, you know. Oh, of course. Restocking city. Yeah, I, I'm assuming I have to give this to the person over here. Off the peanut tree tree. Wait, you're giving it to this to me? Wow, thank you. I've been eating all day. I guess I won't mind if I go and take a short break. Am I gonna be a bad kid and take the coats? Hospital and attendance forms A, F. A through F. Escort and assortment books and pamphlets and the shelves and newspaper, newspaper clipping is sticking out from between the two books. Read it? Yep. Uh, already sharp resources, hospitals are unable to accommodate new patients. I guess I'll do the mill. So, a year's worth of medical journals. Alright, lower cabinet. Medical, medical forms, the land card is up to the back on one of the folders. Read the card, well, yeah, sorry. 1721. I'm going to save that real quick. This doesn't seem right. Why am I stealing past goats? 1721. Well, what do I do now? Until it, there is broken, some metal thing is stuck inside. If you have to go, I'll probably want to find a different bathroom. Hello. What are you doing? I um. Girls from you know. Wait, for, wait, damn it. Winston, what's up? My wife has been to sleep for months now. Oh god, this. But I still talk to with her every day, and sometimes I read to her. How are you doing today? How many other folks are here? Oh, never mind. Hello there. So, you want to use our bathroom, eh? Well, I guess. Yeah, I, I get it. We all gotta go sometimes. But I can't let anyone else use the bathroom. It's a girl's room, you know? Gosh, looks like you really gotta go, though. Hmm. Well, how about this? See that door next to me? Yep! That's my marble collection. I'm missing some, though. I was carrying a bunch of them around in my pocket, and I'm pretty sure some fell out. We could find me just one. I'll let you use the bathroom whenever you want. You think you can do that for me? I'll try my best. Thank you. Last place I was playing was with Danielle in the cafeteria, so you might want to check around there. Okay. Safety. Okay, hang on. Was was the authored personnel over here? All right, seventeen twenty-one. I need a code. Put the doorknob. Is it electric? The doorknob. Entry passcode level closet 5C. However, it doesn't appear to be turned off. Oh. Son of a bitch. Now, like I said, I got the code. Now I gotta go find some marbles. It's a broom! It's a box! It's magazines, notebooks, and other paper, paper materials that can be found here! It's canned goods! Ice cream and other frozen snacks! It's a space heater! Very strange and yogurt. Oh, where is this marble? Danielle, have you found the marble? What's up? You like cats, right? I love them. Aren't they the best? I have like four of them at home. All goes well. I'll have lucky number five by the end of this year. What's up? Okay. Mr. Kitty Cat, do you have the marble? Oh, it's just need toys. Looks like there's someone underneath one of the toys. It's a no we mar Oh, hey, it's a marble. I thought it was another like I thought it was an actual kitten underneath there for some reason. I cannot hear myself think. 
This music is super loud. I think it was this bottom one, right? Aha! I found you your marble! Hey, look. Here's your snowy marble. Ah, you found my snow world. Snow world? Shh! You keep a secret! Yeah? These aren't just marbles, you know. They're little worlds. All these are tiny planets. With tiny people living inside. Ah, oh, damn it. This world I marble is a snow world. It's snowing all the time there. I know this might sound boring, but it's not. Yeah, it just sounds awesome. There's a snowman live there. And they're always having parties. What kind of parties? Snowman dance parties. <laughs> I love dancing. Me too. Oh, they have pretty lanterns everywhere else too. The blue campfire that feels cold. But if we weren't there, but if we were, if we, yeah, but if we went there, we wouldn't freeze. So somebody make a magical drink that keep us, keep a person warm. So we dance with them. It never gets too cold. That sounds great. Thanks for helping me. I feel better now that they're back with me. My name's Sue. It's nice to meet another kid around here. Oh yeah, feel free to use the bathroom anytime you want. If you find any more of these marbles, do you think, do you think you can bring them to me? Of course. Thank you so much. Oh, well, let's see what's up with this bathroom, I guess. This is a portal to it. There's a tunnel running through the here that has been blocked off. Perhaps you can get through it if you have the right tools. It's like a toilet. Looks like. Bless you. Yeah, take it. Pony's bathroom. Yeah, fix your toilet. Wait, you fixed it? Thanks, kid. God. Sorry, I just stepped on your paintings. Hey, pony, I found your key. Why is this here? <laughs> read, read notice. Do not tamper with this device. Oh, pull a lever. Uh, this play is on. I can't mess with this toilet. Why is it? It's 1721. Why am I doing this? Uh, I mean, it's whatever. Fuck. Turn up. <laughs> what the fuck? All tactics are urgent. Please, be tr Please begin transferring the medical supplies to the second floor storage wing immediately. Someone has etched something into the edge of this bolting board. You're dead. Okay. There's this tunnel. Yeah, there's another tunnel. Got the right tools. Over the cabinet. Cabinet is locked. Uh, I guess I'll look this. Some books and payments with lines of shelves, clippings. I believe I read this before. Yeah, read it. Ooh. The NSA said the numbers of people exposed to the radiation were expected to rise. Workers in protective clothing scanned people arriving in evacuation centers for radioactive exposure. So we use it with medical journals. Let's fill the medical forms. It looks like there's something beneath the folders. Let's take the five gold. Oh, no, never mind. Small cap. Damn it. Stop. Stop. No. Cabinet. Use the small. There's an animated card laying at the bottom of this drawer. Get the card. Exit code. 2954. I'll remember that. Someone's on the side. We're able to keep everyone alive, but the treader pissed. What the hell's going on? Is this a horror game, actually? Uh, you know, I feel, I feel like my brain's not going to be able to remember that, actually. Oh, it's a, it's a light. Patient. 122 bullet samples. Isn't that me? No, can't. Fuck. I have to, I, that makes me a little annoyed that I have to wait for that, but I mean, you know. D. I went the wrong way. 54. What is happening? Am I gonna ever get more to it? Or 
door's locked. Yeah, let's knock on the door. Teacher staff, a representative from Oda Construction is coming tomorrow to serve the damage. Please make sure all personal materials are removed before then. Jar with an unknown specimen floating around. You can stop that, please. Okay, I think we're gonna we're gonna go for a little bit longer because it's getting getting pretty interesting. Glasses. Door's locked. Okay, so I'm seeing this up here. I'm assuming this is a regular puzzle where I need to push stuff out of the way. Okay. Hmm. I'm assuming that goes there. I've already, I've already screwed it up. I don't know where I have. Yep, son of a bitch. All right, give me a second. Hey, I'm, it's gonna take me a while. I already know it will. Maybe I'm just doing this wrong. I didn't think I was gonna be able to push it on that. But I mean it's whatever. Let me let me save. But yeah. This is definitely getting good. Oop. Critical pamphlets and office supplies. Oh, what the hell is gonna be said? Same thing. I'm assuming there's a key. Scrubs, looks like there's something. I know inside. Metal door. I can't read the sign. I'm assuming this is like radiation. Warning construction zone ahead. Okay, please do not enter without explosive permission from your supervisor. Why am I going here? What is that? What is that? Why? Why am I exploring this? Um, it's concrete. Stack of folders. Folder 1. Construction contract for the rebuilding of the third folder. Bring 2B. Received a car key, a key card. So I'll have to note here. Read it, Joey. Uh, Joji, I remember remove. I remember to move the card when you, you're done using it this time. Okay, I can't just go leaving doors open. I don't want to get in trouble again. You found five. Found five gold. Doors locked. Yeah, the doors locked. Get the key card. I'll have the right key card. Dingleberries. I'm gonna go find a key card. Get out of my way. This rolls up. It's supposed to read it. Security purses. All three supervisors' key cards must be inserted in do in order to open this this yeah, this door. Well, where do I go? Let's get the other key cards. This is a tunnel that has been blocked off. What's gonna do? Well, where do I get the other key cards? Take it all. I got the key card. I do. I think. Mean... Yeah, can I take it out? Oh, okay. Open says me. It was the tax farms. Oh God, this is a horror game. Open the locker. Key card. Take it. I found a key card. Tech key card. Card deception. This is probably gonna be this is gonna be a decent long episode because I wanna I, I wanna get down to the bottom of this. Let me guess. A key card! Open the locker! And here with key card. Take it. Got the key card. Open the door. Or more like Oh wait, hang on, I'm stupid. I don't need to take the key cards. I just gotta put this key card over here. Which doesn't make any sense. Why is there a double you know what? Whatever. I don't know why I don't know why I'm questioning why there is like a door that requires another door. Where am I going? Hmm? <gasps> it's my book! Oh god. 
Old man. It's a little late for visitors, don't you think? Who are you? Oh, I'm no one important. But if you want to call me something, you can call me... Uma. Uh, are you the one who's been stealing food from the cafeteria? Did you take our book? Heh. I guess you kind of caught me really red-handed. Why don't you steal from a hospital? I'm hungry. Down to my luck. What do you want to say, kid? Wait. Do you live here? For now. Not much of a home, but it beats sleeping on the streets. <laughs> I'm trying to do like a master Roshi. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry you don't have a real home. Eh. You get used to it after a while. So, kid. Are you hungry? I've got a bit of fish head left from last week, if you like. Uh. That's okay. But thank you. Look, kid. I'm really sorry I took your book. Please take it back and forgive me for the lapse of my judgment. You're not gonna kill me, are you? It's okay. I do weird things when I'm hungry, too. You've received a raccoon. And I promise as soon as I get back on my feet, I'll pay that chef back all the food I took. I just need some time to figure things out. I understand. Oh. One more thing. I tell you a secret about this hospital, you will promise you won't tell the staff that I'm here. Okay, I promise. Break me and I'll multiply, come sharp as attack. If all you do is smile on me, I will always smile back. What in the world are you doing here? I... Um... I don't know how you got in this area, but this area is off limits. Anyways, come here. Your mom is here. Okay. <gasps> He's vaping! <laughs> Mother. <laughs> Aww. After you worked so hard to get our book back, I think you deserve a good bedtime story. You don't mean raccoon to me? Mother. Of course I will. I am loving this music, by the way. I haven't said it yet, but... Once upon a time, there lived a boy in a faraway land called Morizora's Forest. Even though he was still quite young, the boy was considered a great warrior by his tribe. One day, the boy returned home from a hunt to find that everyone in his tribe Dead. had disappeared. At first, the boy was very afraid, but he soon learned that his tribe had escaped danger by sailing to a world called Rakuen. In order to reach them, the boy decided to seek help from the great guardian of the forest, Morizora, for it has been said that Morizora would grant one wish to anyone who was able to complete his challenges. Thus, the boy set off on a great journey. He fought evil spirits, visited many lands, and befriended even the most severe of creatures. And at long last, Morizoto granted the boy his wish, a ride on his magical boat. The boy was now able to sail away, finally reuniting with his tribe and all those he loved in the beautiful world of Rakuen. Oh. Good night. Jesus. Mom, is that you? I think it's Yami. I think. Hey, what's up? Hey. Hey, Yami! You came back! I thought you would. It's like the doctor told me we were wandering around the back space. The place is like a construction zone right now, man. Seems awfully dangerous to go there just for a book. Not just a book. It's been in our family for generations. My grandmother used to read it to me when I was... Uh, my grandmother used to read it to my mom when she was a kid. Ah, so you got it back from your mom. Yeah, me too. Especially to both of us. Especially to that old homeless guy too. Silver on his 
Silver on his side probably sells it for a lot. He's hungry. He's probably just trying to make a, you feel sorry for him, so you wouldn't tell on him. He should have felt sorry for you. He should have felt sorry for you. You're stuck in the hospital. You could have leave any time, but you... You might never get to leave. Fuck you too, Yami. Oh, hey, man. I'm sorry for saying that. Okay. It's true. Makes you feeling better. I'm stuck here too. We can both be stuck here together. You're right. Thanks, Yami. I guess that shit, nurse. Sorry, man. I should go. Got me. Yeah. I hope you get better. It's mother. And there's a note on the ground. Hi, mom. Hey, sweetie. Did you sleep okay? Oh, what's the matter? I wish I, could, I, wish I could go to more. Mordozoa and ask him to grant me a wish, but I know it's not real. I'm just stuck here forever, huh, man? Now, I wasn't gonna tell you this until you were older, but I think you might finally—I think you might finally be grown up enough to know the truth about this book. Truth? You know why someone tried to steal our book? What? Because there's silver on it, and people can tell. Steve oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure they would tell them that. So for money? No, no. That's not why at all. This book is just not an ordinary book. It's mapped to Marzoa Forest. A blueprint for when we need to do it to meet Marzoa himself. But, in the from her book, he obviously didn't realize that you need something else in order to get there. That is... <gasps> Guess! This is the raccoon key. You need to open the book as well as the doors. The doors? My grandmother told me that. When you have the book, both the book and the key, secret doors will start appearing around you. Doors that lead from this world to Mortazora Forest. I'm probably saying that wrong. I literally just heard it by you. There could be doors in this hospital? I don't know. I mean, we may never know unless we look ourselves. I want you to have this key. It's very special, and now it belongs to you. You see the silver raccoon book key. Thank you, Mom! You must promise me that you'll take good care of it. Well, I promise. I will take such a good care of it. Okay, there's only one left to do. Let's go find a door to the board store first. Okay. It looks like someone left it you a note. Read it. <laughs> Break me and I'll multiply. Become sharp as attack. But if you, all you do is smile at me, I will always smile back. If you might need this in writing, there's some, there's somewhere crazy where I live. Uh, I hate. Damn it. <laughs> That's fall back. I figured my knee this isn't writing. There's something crazy where I live. I had something to help you get there. Reflect on it. Well, maybe, maybe you can find it. Okay. Well, uh, I think that's gonna do for right now. <laughs> Hello, mom. Hello, dear. How are you? When I was a little girl. I used to always dream about finding a special door to the Marzo Forest. Okay. This game's pretty charming. I will admit. But yeah. Um. <laughs> that's gonna do for right now. Um. If you like what you saw, you know, like and subscribe, and if you think this is a little charming little game, then you think some people might uh, like watching this, you know, then maybe share this, but that's kind of all I got for right now. I, 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 I'm going to play a little bit more of this. I have other, I have other games that I, I, I did buy that I definitely need to play. Um, along with this, I have, I think... Uh, I, do need, I do need to do more Cult of Land, but as of right now, I think I only have maybe three or four other games that I plan on playing. Uh, yeah, that's good to do for right now, so hope you all take care.